Hey, what's up everyone? This is Jason at Canyon Adventure Vans and today I'm going to show you a new product. The product actually that we've had for a couple years now that we've uh, had on our vans. Um, we pretty much never have sold them on our website until now. So um, we're able to get these manufactured for us instead of us just buying them on Amazon. So now we have these on the website. Um, and basically when you open up the box, this is what you get, two pieces. It's that simple. And the idea of this is we had it at, uh, two years ago at the Adventure Van Expos and we're sitting there and we're obviously showing our back end stuff and mattresses and all that. And that sun was constantly just beating inside the van for, you know, eight, 10 hours a day. So I thought to myself, how can I make a custom awning that doesn't cost a fortune? And uh, we ended up uh, getting some uh, shower curtain rods, cutting them and making them work. And uh, um, we've had enough inquiries in the last two years that we decided just to go get them manufactured and offer them for, I think, $39, I believe we're selling these for. Um, so check it out. So this is what you do. So if you have a Rebel, if you have a Storyteller um, with the Roll F uh, rear screens, all you do is pop these down. So in, a roll, in the Roll F screens on this bottom piece, there's normally, and I don't know what happened to mine, it's probably gone, but there's normally a piece of um, foam in, in here. So just a round piece of foam that goes all the way in here that just keeps it kind of straight, right? So it doesn't do all this and buckle and everything like that. So all you're gonna do is slide that foam out save it, trash it, do whatever. And then you're gonna take our new um, awning pole and then you're gonna slide this in here, just like so, all the way to the end. And you'll grab the other one. You'll kind of slide it so you can see the end. Slide that on there. And then I kind of even it out, just make sure, you know, it's probably like a foot on each side. And then I just come out here and I roll it up. Try to get it as even as possible. And then I'll clip it. Crank that down so it's nice and tight. Do the same thing on this one. Clip that in place, cinch it down, and then you can sit here and we put little grippy pieces on the ends so it won't slide down. And basically that holds your doors from coming in as well, but it gives you a lot of shade and just, it's really nice. You can raise it up, you know, if you're a really tall person, you can even raise it up as high as, it, you, know, as, high as you want it. But that's the idea is you get all this shade. So if you're sitting in the back, you got your GLSS back here or you're just hanging out even at night, just having your doors open and being able to have this awning is pretty cool. Um, and then that's it. So it just adds a lot of extra shade back here. And then to take it down, it's super simple. All you do is, there's actually a couple ways. You can just unplug this. So a lot of times if I'm at the shows, I'll just go like this, pop this out, put this piece in here like so, right? And then I'll just roll it back up all the way, which I'm gonna do when we're done here. But you can also just let this go all the way down and then just tuck this um, rod back in there as well. But since we're gonna do it like this, all I do is just roll this up. Buckle it in. Cinch it up. And that's it, your awning pole is already in there. It's always ready to use. So anytime you wanna, you get to camp, it's literally super easy. Just come in here, drop it down, slide this piece in here. Get it to where you like it. Kinda open the door a little bit so it slides in there. Just like that, and you're done. That's our awning pole, super easy. You don't have to stow it anywhere because anywhere, it's already stowed in your Roll-F uh, bug screens. So 
Check it out on the website, canyoninventurebands.com. Thank you.